and thank you to the organizations that uh, actually were able to put together this evening's debate. I am honored and pleased to be here with you. Thank you for showing up, all of you who are here, who are invested and interested in civics and governance. My name is Sheila Dow Ford, and I am the candidate for Congress in PA 17. I am running on the Democratic ticket. If you can't hear me, let me know. I can speak very loudly. At one point in time, I was a preschool teacher, and I know how to use my, my voice very loudly. Is this better for everyone? Yes. Is this yes. a bit better? Then I will use this, because I think that the, my voice carries a bit better with this. I'd like to spend a few moments telling you a bit about myself, I know that uh, there are faces here that are somewhat familiar, but I think it's important for me to review for you my credentials and to explain why I am, in fact, a candidate for public office. I am an honors graduate of LaSalle University. I graduated with high honors. I'm a graduate of Penn Law School. I uh, live in Harrisburg, Pennsylvania currently. I have relatives that uh, lived in central Pennsylvania, so I have roots in central PA. I like to say that I am the great-granddaughter of former dairy farmers who then moved to Philadelphia, who when they retired, they decided that they would get back to the land, and they bought another farm in Bucks County, Pennsylvania. So I have lived very close to the land. Uh, the soil is sort of under my fingernails, but I also like to believe that uh, while we are close to the land. We are also people who have roots in urban areas as well. I indicated that I live in Philadelphia. I have family that's from Steelton. I have uh, relatives who were teachers in the school, Steelton School District many years ago, and also who worked in the mills. My husband, Les Ford, um, is a person who grew up in Evansville, Indiana. He and I have been married for about 29 years, give or take a year. I always, I'm not quite, I think it's 29. You get to a point where it's not that diminishing returns set in, you're just not so sure. <laughs> I think it's 29. I'm very good with math as well. <laughs> it's not diminishing returns at all, however. No, it's, it's actually quite good. It, and the fact is that Les grew up, as I said, in, Indi in Evansville, Indiana, and Les actually worked in a steel mill. He put himself through school from college working in a steel mill in Gary, Indiana. He worked at Gary Works. And there are actually steel workers still around um, who are active um, in the union, in USW, who actually know less. And I've made connections with them as I've reached out to unions and other trade organizations. I think that's important because I want you to know a little bit about who I am, about who I'm married to, about um, our family. I, and so we can go on from there. Um, Please. Why don't, you, why don't you continue? I'm going to, Karen, since we don't have a timer. I have a timer. 